From a food and beverage perspective, um, we have a, a couple key uh, members of the team that are joining us. We have a brand new executive chef who will be starting soon. Um, our former executive chef from a couple seasons back, uh, Will, will be returning as our director of operations. So some familiar faces for us, uh, and we're e eager to, to get them kind of in action. Um, there's a couple things that we wanted to highlight from a food and beverage perspective. Uh, there's a concept that they've uh, created that's our Bricktown Chili Cart. And so we're actually going to take some of the items that had been in our key uh, primary Flashpoint grill and move those to the chili cart. So there'll be an OKC Coney dog, there'll be Frito chili pie, and it'll be a specific location on the concourse that people can go and get that. Um, our grab and go, we'll see kind of a refresh. Um, and one of the things that, um, that, that really stood out to me is we'll be doing hand spun cotton candy there at grab and go. Um, this is right near our Flashpoint 108. Uh, which is the, the workhorse of our concessions around the ballpark, and so many people are, are drawn to Flashpoint. Uh, stepping out of line and jumping over the grab-and-go will be an easy way for our fans to access most of the things that they're, that they're seeking. Um, Margaritaville uh, continues to be a real success. This is you know, cocktails and, and particularly focused on margaritas, so we're actually adding a second location this year uh, to keep up with the interest and volume. One of the, th the lessons learned from last year, uh, we had great success with beer bats, and I'm certain that people are familiar with it. All over social media, um, we had these uh, over 6,000 of them sold over the course of the season last year. Um, so we're borrowing that same concept and applying it to our margaritas. We'll have margarita um, bats, a 16 ounce bat, that people are able, able to enjoy that beverage throughout the game, um, and something that, uh, that we know will be very popular. Um, a couple of just last thoughts related to the, the point, point of sale system. Uh, we are really most interested in the ability to really increase the speed of service. And so um, um, about 20 new points of sale, uh, locations that people are gonna be able to get their order into the system. Um, eight alone at Flashpoint 108, our primary uh, concession stand. Um, there'll be touch screen, and as I mentioned, uh, handle digital payments. Uh, so we're really um, confident that from the moment you enter the queue line to the moment you're placing your order is going to rapidly increase and then we'll um, be able to expedite everyone's food um, by queuing them over to uh, a certain space in the concession stand itself. Um, so that should have a, a really positive impact on the overall food and beverage experience for our fans this year.